Hello, Scorpio. Getting ready to do your reading. Let's see what is going on for you, Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. All right. There we go. What is the overall energy? Oh, three came out. The three of coins, the lovers, and the six of swords. Uh, that can be interpreted a lot of different ways. I'm seeing the seven of swords under the deck with the two of coins. I feel like there's somebody who you may not be around right now, who may be at a distance, but there was a strong connection. You guys were together. You can be together in different ways with the three of coins because that can be like group friends, travel, work, uh, you know, anything. So I'm not going to go into everything, but, but I feel like this person may have had feelings for you. Maybe they showed a little bit of them. Maybe they didn't. Maybe they weren't sure if you were single or available, or they just weren't sure if they should communicate how they felt. Could be a Libra, but um, more than likely, this could be coming back into your life. This may have been six months ago or past this past June. Okay. How is this person feeling? How is this person that Scorpio is potentially dealing with feeling? So they're worried. Okay. One more, please. Okay. Four of wands. Okay. Well, you may not know or see Scorpio. The three of, three of wands. This is on the horizon. And then what is the potential outcome at this point? The two of swords. Okay. Someone's doing a lot of thinking here, a lot of overthinking. I think it may be the other person, Scorpio. They may be worried about how you feel about them or your response to them or, you know, Seven of Wands is under the deck right now. So I don't know if that's you pushing them away or them wanting to fight for this or what we're seeing here. What is this overall energy here for Scorpio? We have the Nine of Coins, the Three of Swords, and the King of Cups. So stars under here. I feel like there's somebody who definitely had their eye on you, Scorpio. They may have seen you as very beautiful or handsome, independent. Uh, they may be brokenhearted that the two of you are not together. They could be a water sign like you, or this is you, but I kind of feel like it's the other person. I feel like this other person is emotional. You guys spent some time together. So, I mean, it could have been a day, a couple days. It could have been years. I don't know. But this person right now, the two of you may not be communicating or I mean, you guys maybe could be arguing. It's not showing that here, but there's definitely something going on here between the two of you. Now, I don't see you stressing those Scorpio Nine of Coins. I think that's you. But what is this Nine of Swords? What is this Nine of Swords? The Four of Wands again. The Six of Swords. Wow. And the Nine of Coins. So it's like this person didn't want to leave. They didn't want to have to go back home. They are reminiscing about the past. There could be a, a child, usually it's an older child with the Nine of Coins. Like, like maybe they had to go take care of something, um, go off to college or school or something. I got somebody who was going in the military because, yeah, I'm seeing the hermit under the deck. So that means it was a disappearance or there's been time apart or no communication. So what is this Four of Wands here? What is this Four of Wands here for Scorpio? Eight of Wands, the Nine of Swords. See, this person wants to reach out to you, Scorpio, but they may be afraid you will block them. You're under the deck, so let's see. You got Strength card behind you. Maybe it's a Leo. Got Gemini energy, lovers, and death. Wow. So you guys were lovers, but then it ended, and it's been difficult possibly for you or both of you. Feeling out in the cold. Wow. Wow. This is like two people who came together, maybe suddenly, and had this really strong connection, very heated, passionate connection, but then it ended suddenly and then it's been difficult for both of you. One of you or both of you or someone might be married, of course, but um, this person wants to reach out to you. They want to tell you something. They want to talk to you, Scorpio, but they are afraid you're going to block them. So what is the three of wands and the unknown, the hidden? What is the three of wands? We have the Emperor Energy, the Magician, and the Ten of Wands. So this person's going to do it, though. The Sun. They may even move. Ten of Wands will be my moving card. But it's like this person's saying, you know, forget it. I'm not going to be worried about this anymore. I'm not going to stress. I'm just going to go for it. What is the Ten of Wands? What is the Ten of Wands? I mean, obviously, they could be feeling, oh, yep, they're way down. They feel way down. So that's what I was going to say. Out in the cold, so they're missing you. Hmm. What is the Two of Swords and the outcome? What is this Two of Swords and potential outcome? The Knight of Wands. The Tower, the Three of Wands, we do one more, and the King of Wands, wow. So this person is kind of like I'm getting all in. They're leveling up. They are very passionate about you. Look at how they're looking over at you, Scorpio. You're looking over at them. There's a very strong connection here. Now there could be somebody else you are with who's disappointed this is going on. You know, that could be. Some may be left out in the cold because of this very strong connection, unfortunately. This may be an Aries specifically, but this is somebody who... Again, maybe they were a player. Maybe you're the one who changes their heart and their mind, possibly. Or they're just 
you're the one, maybe they want to settle down because this is a change. This is a big change. Knight of Wands, the tower now coming in as the King of Wands. So there's something that's changed with this person or, or you guys were together. I mean, this could have been a hookup, something very fast, something like that possibly. And they can't let this go. You've been on their mind this whole time. It almost looks like they live with someone else possibly with the Four of Wands. May not be married, that's a relationship card to me, but they went back to the situation, whatever it was. Of course, it could be work and family, but that uh, they keep reminiscing, looking at the past with you. But so when I say going all in, also I have cards here. Like a, that's my like, buying a plane ticket possibly. You see the plane, oh, Seven of Swords. Money, Seven of Swords, Six of Coin. Hmm. The Ten of Wands, feeling way down, but again, could be possibly moving. The Tower, again, possible move or change, major change, so that they can come see you again, talk to you, be with you. This person might have come across as a player, and they may not be. They may be well-to-do, possibly, with what I'm seeing here. This almost looks like they're stealing money, though. The Ten of Coins, to the Seven of Swords, to the Six of Coin, but... Um, Again, they may have had long-term idea, like long-term in mind, but yet they really didn't say anything. The Four of Cups is under, um, in reverse under the deck. They didn't take action. There was love. See that? The Two of Cups. Could be married, wanting to get married. Ten of Cups is back here. Could have lied to you also, unfortunately, about being married to somebody, but... Um, this could be someone else who breadcrumbed you in the past. I mean, they may have done something. What's the Seven of Wands? Okay, let's just keep going. What's the Seven of Wands? Why are they so worried that you will possibly block them? Okay. Uh, they could. You could be with someone else. Maybe you have an earth sign attached to you. Maybe they feel like they don't have the money. Something along that line. What is this King of Coins sitting here? It could be a King of Coin. What is this King of Coin? Two of Wands taking Six of Wands victory. Seven of Wands can mean fighting for this also, but again, this is that energy of this person's deciding what they're going to do, that they're going to take action. Instead of reminiscing and leaving this on hold, they're going to do something about it. Knight of Coins, please. Yeah, there's that decision card, saying things differently. differently. This can be being stubborn. This can be being insecure, ego in the way. So you can see that this maybe has taken a while. This person's been in their head a lot, or maybe, maybe they've been in a bad situation a bad relationship no nope. i'm gonna go for something oh they're gonna get out of something too possibly that makes sense for someone king of cups holding back this person's holding back a lot they want a new beginning with you go to the king of wands so yep they could be traveling to visit you <clears throat> excuse me and they may be sad about this they haven't moved on they want to work things out and they are being dead serious, the King of Swords energy. They see you as an Empress. Okay. Wow. They want to communicate with you. Okay, so the reading is very, very clear. You might have several people interested in you, Scorpio, also, because you do have every king out here. So that there may be competition, but I and maybe that's what slowed them down. But I'm seeing this person getting the courage up and just coming in. All right. Let me see. Let me go to a different deck. I really don't know what else to say. It's pretty straightforward, but let's go pull some clarifiers. I was wondering if I should extend this one. This is somebody who's very passionate about you, Scorpio. Somebody there is a connection, though it's going to vary by who's viewing. Because for some of you, I feel like this could have been something that was intended to be like a weekend getaway or one night stand or something like that. And it tur is turning into something else. Others of you know this could be somebody you have known longer. Okay. Yeah, heart with the key. So you must have the key to this person's heart, Scorpio. Lightning, yeah, sudden change and shocking news. We did see that tower, so I am not surprised to see that. Upheaval, transformation, epiphany, and love. Okay, so someone is going to tell you, and that's I, I felt like there was going to be possibly an engagement. I felt like someone may propose to you, Scorpio, out of the blue. And it may be because they want to kind of like jump to the head of the line when it comes to love with you. Like they want to be the one, like they were holding it in. So some of you Scorpios have several people you're dealing with. I can see that here. It's pretty, pretty evident, pretty obvious. But um, again, this person could be coming back in. And, and again, I'm seeing, yeah, proposal. So let me see if there's something they want to say. Let me pull one card. I think I will extend this one. 
Let's see who this is, what this is. Sometimes I stay awake thinking about you. And it says, I can't stop thinking about you. So I'm seeing some obsessing. So maybe this devil energy is obsessing. And this person is tired of obsessing. You know when you think about something for a long time and you're like, like just take action, just do something. You know what? That's what I'm seeing here with this, with this man or woman, who did, whoever this is. So I think I will extend it to see more about what's going on. Link is below, Scorpio. Have a great week, and I'll talk to you soon.